Can I just say I forgot how good I look without a beard too, or with a shorter beard? Can I just say how I forgot how sexy I am as a person? Okay, I just, I forgot. We're gonna pause here for a second, just so I can talk more, right? I, I wanna drag it out. I look, okay, this looks a little soft. Hold on, no, I'm gonna get the other half of my mustache. Are you, are you, are you referring to like, <laughs> you mean the last 28 days? I said that I needed to talk about Wick. I mean, that's politics, really. But I'll just show this picture that Stylo wanted me to show, I guess. Is this like, what, what, when's this picture from? Do Wick tent. Dude, there is no fucking Wick tent. It's him talking to nobodies about the election. It's fucking boring. Oh, well, you see, the lefties, it's all of the lefties' fault. Come on, I didn't say lefties bad enough. Kamala, Kamala didn't uh, call out the lefties for being uh, retarded, dude. It's so fucking shallow, such shallow retarded analysis, dude. What is going on here anyway? Why, where's his beard gone? He shaved live on stream because they paid him. Okay. Well, send me a link to that. I'll watch that. As long as it's not fucking his dog shit takes on politics. Bro, a political pack paid okay, this guy money. If I, bro, why, why dude? Bro, it's so crazy, bro. <laughs> Thank you for the five dollars. How I'm, I'm, I don't do, I don't do that shit. I don't do. Oh, I'll do things for money. That's insane. I'd never, ever, in a million years, do shit like that. It's not never gonna happen. What is this? I'm in a fortunate financial position that I don't need to, you know, be a dancing monkey, i.e. you give me money and I'll do something, <laughs> you know? <laughs> what is this? When does the beard shaving start? Oh, here we go. I predicted this. I told you. Who are you going to listen to? The guys who were wrong or the guy who was right? Look, I didn't get it 100% right. I had some predictions that were wrong. That's true. But the difference between... Bro, who the fuck would listen to dude? Who? I mean, I say who would listen to this guy. I think the figures make it quite clear that not very, not very many people listen to him anyway. But this guy is like such a fucking... Okay, that's so wonderful. useless. But how it's crazy how all these people got paid this PV people. money. Wick looks like the villain's henchman that blindly follows him. Thank you for the super chats. In me and others is when I get it wrong, I'll be like, oh man, I messed up here. I was wrong. And tell you what, if Harris... Bro, I literally one, don't care I, about his political and, takes. Shave your beard off now. Uh, Shuboot says, I really don't think Biden... Shave your beard. Failure. Just do shit like that. They Shave your beard. <sighs> There we go. Why would you vote for that? Now we're talking. Why? Dude, there's no way, dude. I got. I need to move a camera so you can see the full, the full image, dude. Is he doing this for money? Can someone explain to me what happened here? We're getting it now, boys. He's. Is he that hard up for cash that he's got to shave his beard for money? Am I understanding this correctly? Guys. Oh, it was a bet. Oh, okay. You made a bet over the election or something. Dude, I my I I I've got a feeling that this progressive victory money is gonna start to dry up. And all these people who have been fucking living the life of Riley off the back of super PAC money are gonna have a a, a short, sharp awakening. I mean, I, I could be wrong. I just don't see how progressive victory can justify continuing to pay retards like Wick and Xanderhal, you know, in light of the recent result. Like, what, what the fuck are they going to, you know, like, what value are they going to bring to to anything, you know? Oh, my God, dude. This is, this is Kino. I'm glad we watched this. Dude, what? This is so... This is, like, so... 
I've oh, like I've always had a policy. No, like this is like the, um, what is it? Wings of Redemption. I just don't think you should do this kind of like. Oh, I'll do you know insert thing here for money or whatever it is. Even if it's some bet over the election, I just think you're you're sullying yourself by doing stuff like this. I may have to take off my glasses here. And it's, don't worry, it's not over my keyboard, gang. It's not over my keyboard. Uh, it's over trash can. Okay. I got like this. Uh, I got a whole setup, okay? I got a whole setup where there's like a plastic cover and stuff. Just catch some of this hair, right? But uh, can I just say I forgot how good I look without a beard too? Or with a shorter beard? Can I just say how I forgot how sexy I am as a person? Okay, just, I forgot. Connor Boyce did a response to the election talking about time with PV and to the fact he was soft on yeah I mean yeah he was obviously soft on Bosch I'm being reminded because you both yeah. both of them with PV and he says it was right when you and him talked about food shops dude that was so insane right he was fucking annoyed at me because I didn't go hard enough on fucking food shops meanwhile he's like not saying anything about Vosh the big political streamer caught with this crazy porno and then when he got challenged on it, he was like, oh, I guess I could send him a message about it. <laughs> Bro, it's so obvious, dude. <laughs> oh, my God, dude. In retrospect, I may not have wanted to, to wear the hoodie. I may have wanted to be shirtless, but no. Too late now. I'll just do the laundry after. That's all. Oh my god, dude. It's so oh god, it's rough to watch. This is like when that crazed bitch shaved off her hair. What was that person's name? That were they Jewish or Israeli or something? Katie, yes. It, this reminds me of Katie. That girl, Katie, is really... Co well, I don't know about the coke addict part. I'm taking your word for that, but, you know. We're going to pause here for a second. Just so I can talk more, right? I, I want to drag it out. I look, okay, this looks a little so Hold on. No, I'm going to get the other half of my mustache before I stop, okay? Um, oh my God, dude. Why do this? Is it? Is it a bet? It is a bet, right? I need true information about this. He lost a bet over the election. Is that what it is? Oh no, it's nearly done. He's nearly done. Oh no, he's nearly done. <laughs> Can you guys hear me? He does look better with a beard. It must Not be said. Not perfect yet. I need to get patches. It's a little patchy right now. Beardless wick. Yeah. What do you guys think? Also, how many viewers did he have when he did this? Oh, we're gonna. Okay. At the same time as we're doing this, we're going to chuck the Tom Tent in too. We're going to do a, a double glup shito. Can someone please link me Tom going over his analytics that Queenman was watching last night? Can someone please put that on my Discord? I need it urgently. You guys like <laughs> it? Which do you like better, bearded or beardless? You hate it? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Look, 500 bucks, I'll, I'll shave my beard every time, right? Surprisingly cute. Well, thank you, PVP. Thank you. Tessie Johnson says it's like oh, you were God, trying dude. to look old before. Like people. Oh, Raul, is this. Oh, Raul Curtin else has got it. Okay. Like I said, I need to trim, get some of these patches out. But as it comes. Okay, look, back to the matter at hand. About how Wick was right. About everything. Okay. Not everything, but a good portion. Bro. What? Like, how many viewers does this guy get? 
So what if you were fucking right about everything? You don't get any fucking viewers. Like what? <laughs> you got no viewers. You got no influence. You're nobody. I'm nobody too. Okay, I'm nobody as well. Don't get it wrong. I'm not saying I'm influential, but it's just so wild. This kind of unearned sense of self-importance that he's got. I mean, the VOD has got a total of just over a thousand views. So I'm guessing he probably had what fifty viewers live, something like that. We need to recognize um, that while yes, the economy played a large, a large, uh, and, and bro, I just I instantly tune out, instantly, instantaneously tune out when he talks about politics. Who cares what Wicker's got to say about politics, dude? And the viewers agree, it seems. The the view the viewers agree because he doesn't get that many views. <laughs> oh man. That's rough. Yeah, I think and I don't like to make predictions too confidently because who fucking knows? Anything could happen. But I don't know, I just I get I really struggle to see what progressive victory. Okay. Well, hang on a sec. People were saying it was a bet. But here it says, 500 bucks to shave my beard on stream. Okay, easy money, baby. So, to me, it seems that they're saying, give me 500 bucks and I'll shave on stream. Not actually some sort of bet. Yeah, it's like, this is like DSP sniffing his chair for $50, debasing yourself for, you know, little portions of cash here and there. But I could be wrong. I don't know the story of this. Maybe there was some bet, but this makes it sound like he was given $500 by someone to shave his beard. Um. So yeah, he's trying to do the I was right thing. One comma <laughs> This is this is fucking bleak, dude. <laughs> oh, but yeah, I mean, I just you know, if I was like a political organization, and I was looking at the outcome of the result, and I was looking at my outgoings, and I seen I'd paid these fucking retards money, and the election hadn't gone the way that I wanted, you know, local outcomes hadn't happened the way I'd wanted, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, you know, it's like yeah, this seems like a waste of money. And I think some of it is baked in in terms of like you're expecting people like Wick and Xanderhall to give you insights on, on content creation and what to do. You know? Just seems really stupid and a waste of money to me. Anyway, that's my take on this fucking moron. Let's see what else we got. So we've got the timestamp here for... I don't think Tom Fuller is associated with Progressive Victory, but he's another, you know, totally wretched, moronic Twitch poll guy desperately trying to make it happen despite everything telling him it's not going to work. His viewership, his subscriber count, um, and as you're going to find out, his revenue also. <laughs> Let's have a little look at this. Okay. Yeah. Um, from what I looked at, it is saying that... I'm running some sort of scam and it says that I was even, it made it look like what I'm wondering is did somebody did like anybody, did any of my mods like post a link to any websites or anything in that chat? Cause I don't have that chat up anymore and I lost the entire, I lost the entire chat and the entire VOD. So I can't go look at the VOD and see what happened. that easy to take a channel down no they didn't take my channel down my channel's still up obviously i was just, it only took that stream down and i was able to just restart the stream so like i i'm not like really in trouble um they gave me a warning for it but i was still able to appeal the warning <laughs> he's like a race car you know when race cars have got all the fucking shit on it it's like it's like that with stream listen i know i've got goals so maybe you might think i'm hypocritical for this Donate with super chats and big letters constantly support the stream. 
And so. And you're going to find out very shortly that these messaging aspects don't seem to be particularly effective. <laughs> we'll see in just a sec. Yeah, I don't. Uh, I don't know what the. I don't know. I, I the last stream just got taken down. Like that's all I know is that yeah, it just it just got taken down. Um, testicle John saying member for sixteen months. I am okay. This timestamp is stupid. Yeah, this is not this the right timestamp. Spam and. Uh, I want to see his analytics. Wait, did we just hit two million views? Here we go. For real? Now we we're just talking. Hit two million. Now we're talking. We literally just hit a million. After like four years, we just hit a million. Like, like six months ago. <laughs> and I think we just just put the pizza in the box, bro. Yeah, sure. I'll take the upsell. Give me the garlic bread with the Pepsi too. Just fucking listen. I just want to pay for my pizza, okay, <laughs> dude. Just hit two million. <laughs> oh. No? This says one million, like one and a half million. And this says new achievement, two million views. What? <laughs> I'm so, dude, what is up with YouTube? Today it's been, it's been super glitchy today. This video here oh. said. Yes. Try to figure out whether the 500 views are correct or the 1,000 views are correct. I'm also blocking it, so I'll move it up here. But can you see here? You've got channel analytics. Okay. Last 28 days. Estimated revenue. $605. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. That is not looking too pretty, is it? Six hundred and five dollars, bro. Doesn't this does this guy do this full time? That's huge. I take an extra six hundred dollars a month from a hobby. I thought he was full time, wasn't he? Or he was at one point. He tried to go full time. Or did he go back to it being part time? But anyway, I don't think it's a hobby. I think I think he treats it as a part time job at least. Oh, Stylo knows. He went back to work. He tried full time a year ago. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Uh oh. Chud pocket watching. Well, a bit empty. The pockets are a bit empty on this occasion, aren't they? <laughs> oh, boy. Hey, I see. Thank you for the five gifted. Appreciate okay, that's it. Wonderful. But how do I make money? It had zero views for like two hours. And I was getting tons of comments, tons of, it already had. What's your monthly? Bit gauche. Bit gauche, isn't it? Dude, I'm not going to start getting into all the ins and outs of my fucking revenue, okay? All you need to know, all you need to know is, is it's decent. Let's just say it's more than $600, okay? Right. Let's say let's just say it's more than six hundred dollars. Let's put it that way. Okay. It's not pocket watching when he's walking around with him turned inside out. Dude, that's so mean, bro. Had <clears throat> like twenty thumbs ups on it, and it still said it had zero views. Right now it says it has five hundred and thirty nine views. And if you go to my channel you can see it says 1.5 thousand right there. But here, it says there's 530. Wait, hang on a sec. Oh my, I mean, this is, the, okay. He's, he is right. He's not wrong that there are sometimes discrepancies between viewership and what your stats say on the main page, okay? But we're talking about like a, a piddling dif difference. A thousand views. Like, bro. You know, this guy, I feel like he's got so into the idea of these like little dif discrepancies and stuff. It's like, it's totally irrelevant. It doesn't fucking matter. And 
it doesn't make any fucking difference to your fucking day to day life as a YouTuber. Um, what the views are like? It's just so stupid and such a waste of time to worry about stuff like this. And yeah, he did this with something else as well. I feel like. Chad, forget where you come from. That discrepancy is an extra cheesy bread. Okay, dude. <laughs> but here it says there's 539 views. YouTube has been screwy today, dude. I don't know what's going on. Oh, this is, uh... yeah. The, it's basically it's like people think that they can trick their way into doing well. People think that they can like trick the system and suddenly be successful. And one thing I've noted that this guy does, okay is he will stream on a normal this sort of format right on a on a landscape format but he also does a portrait vertical stream format too at the same time because there was this narrative that you could get loads of views on these vertical streams on youtube because i believe it counts it in a similar way to how tiktok does so your viewership is massively inflated but the truth of it is i mean obviously there's a human being behind that and the way in which people are engaging with short content or the, the, you know, vertical streaming format is scrolling and stuff and it's an impression and stuff like that. You know, you're not getting meaningful viewers out of that. Yeah, didn't didn't that Femios person try that and was like super excited about getting all these viewers? And it's like, yeah, but you're not actually getting real viewers. You're just getting people that are probably scrolling and your screen shows up for two seconds and then they're on to the next thing, you know? Like you just, you cannot beat, you cannot trick it. You cannot get around it. The only way to make a go of this is to slowly over time, build an audience and it's going to fluctuate. Sometimes it will be increasing. There's some months it will drop a bit and then next month, few months, hopefully it goes up and it's a continual, continual process, you know? And I've seen so many people come through that have had like crazy dramatic increases in short amounts of time. And look, I'm only human. I look at it and I'm like, damn, how are they doing that? You feel a little bit of jealousy. You know, at first, when it first started happening with people, but eventually you come to realize that a lot of this is false and it, it doesn't last. And then there's the inevitable drop off, you know, slow and steady wins the race. You can't out, you can't outplay it. You can't outsmart it. Slowly building an audience is the way to go, you know. And Tom, I think, feels that he can trick it somehow by doing these simultaneous. It just doesn't work. It doesn't help you. And I think the statistics make that very clear, you know? Uh, this is strange. But yeah, right here, it says, new achievement, 2 million views. Looks like your videos are getting more attention. But I, I don't know where this is coming from. Where the oh, fuck? Oh, did I? Sorry. Puddle sucker. Ever since I appeared on his stream, his revenue has plummeted. I hold Tom's keys. Okay, dude, okay. What, dude, why is he showing the innards? What a crazy, bro, hang on. This is, uh, this is strange. But yeah, right here, it says, new achievement, 2 million views. Looks like your videos are getting more attention. But I, I don't know where this is coming from. Where the fuck? I didn't, yeah, I didn't even think I was anywhere close to, to 2 million views. But here we go. Let's have a look. So 2.3 million views. Don't really care about that. Subs, watch time, whatever. What is this? Estimated revenue. I think in lifetime, so since January 18th, 2019, his channel has made a total of $15,324.14. Dude. My big question with this is at what point did this guy think he could go full time? I'm not going to know, dude. I'm not going to show our revenue. Come on, dude. That's gauche. Listen, we're not we're not we're not going to do the humble brag. We're not going to be more of an explicit brag, wouldn't it? We don't need to do it, okay? That's gauche. Dude. Come on, dude. That's just that's that's not on. Oh, okay. I won't do that. I won't do that, okay? I won't show the main channel stats because that is gauche. But I will do this. 
because I'm actually on my second channel at the moment, okay? <laughs> so this is the second channel stats. And since 2022, we've achieved 2 million views and an estimated revenue of 13,479. <laughs> Okay, dude. Now, in fairness, in fairness, you can see there's a lot of period because it lay dormant for quite a long time. And then, yeah, earlier this year, I said to DK, you know, let's reinvigorate the channel. Let's put segments up on it. I'll start doing more gaming streams. And uh, yeah, you can kind of see the, <laughs> the results quite, quite handily there. <laughs> so, yeah. You know. I mean, I don't mean to brag or be gauche or anything, but bro, it's so crazy. All that revenue is from those two spicy chat streams. I'm pretty sure they're like they're here and it's like $18. I'm sorry to break it to you, but that was actually not, not the true, not, not the true route of success for this channel. It's just been regularly up. Dude, it's like the formula, regularly uploading segments and, you know. It was fun, certainly, but re regular uploading segments and me streaming on it, doing gaming streams, has been a tremendous success. So yeah, and you know, dude, I'm not going to show the main channel. It just feels a bit. It, it's it's rubbing it in a bit too much, and I don't want to do that. You know, it's uh, too much, too tacky. I'm not going to do it. Don't worry. I will look for my own benefit though. Ooh. Oh dear. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, we're not doing that. Come on. That's that's bad. That's bad. That's terrible. That's terrible. Poor Tom. Poor Tom. Dude. I think DK. Are you are you, are you referring to like <laughs> You mean the last 28 days? Is that what you, are you talking about the last 28 days? Is that what you mean? Okay, well, yeah, I mean, that's not. <laughs> let's not. <laughs> <clears throat> oh. Come on, dude. That's gauche. No one need, don't ignore that. Cut that out. Cut that bit out, okay, dude? <laughs> 28 days later. Okay, okay. But anyway. It says anyway. I'm at 2.3. Dude, that is so crazy, bro. The channel has gotten 2.3 million views so far. What the fuck? The thing is, is look, to make a serious note, yes, it's very funny. Ha, Tom's a failure. Okay. I'm doing okay. Sure. But if you think about it, it's like, at what point did you think this was viable to go full time on? You know? Like it's it's just absurd. There's no there's no point here on this graph that I think you should consider going full time. Fifteen thousand three hundred. I can't see the stats, but presumably it would be it would be around here. This would be kind of localized. <clears throat> and there's probably some months where maybe he did earn you know thousand two thousand dollars something like that. But the reality is that unless you're consistently earning, you know a few few thousand dollars a month there's literally no reason to to go full time because if you get one month where you do well sure but it needs to be consistent otherwise you're not going to be able to sustain yourself you know and yeah just seems like really foolish to try and make a go of it with these sorts of figures yeah this is weird and then like yeah the estimated Revenue is wrong. I like all, almost all of this out of whack. I don't understand. By the way, that is highly unlikely that the estimated revenue is wrong. That is sounds like complete cope. If it's if it's out over a period of four years, it would probably be out by like a few hundred dollars at most, right? If it's out at all, because. 
the way that it works is it's linked into Google AdSense. So, you know, there's like a, it will give you an estimate. And obviously it then links up with Google AdSense, which then puts money into your Google AdSense account and it all sort of connects up and, and cross references each other. <laughs> so this idea that this estimate of revenue is wrong is is crazy. You know, over a period of four years, maybe there's some discrepancies that might lead it to be at most a hundred dollars here, a hundred dollars there, maybe. But honestly, it's gen genuinely pretty accurate. Um, you know, to the point where I pay DK based off what that's what what that figure shows. You know, and then the only thing that affects it is the exchange rate my end. But other than that, it's you know, in t terms of dollar amount, it's normally pretty much on the money. I mean, 15K in four, dude. <laughs> it feels bad. I'm not trying to be mean. It's just like, bro, what, how retarded do you have to be to, you know, think at any point you could have turned this into a full-time gig? Dude, if I... <laughs> just his face. Is he realizing that he's showing his... Figures. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with YouTube, dude. They're glitching. All right. Former CIA officer at the uh, uh, right for the Washington Post. The U.S. is on the verge of. We're not going to watch all this, obviously. Um, estimated revenue is everything: ad revenue, super chats, memberships, every single way in which YouTube can give you money. It takes into account. So yeah. It's everything. Every single super chat, every single membership, every single fucking cent of ad money, that's in that figure. <laughs> dude. I don't, listen, it feels harsh, bro. I don't mean, uh, dude. I'm not trying to be mean. I am a bit, I guess. What is this? Some more Trump shit. Um, but yeah. Uh, to me, you know, you can have a laugh about him being a total failure, sure. But it's just... It's not really about that for me. It's more so like, why did you ever think that you could turn this into a full-time gig? I guess maybe he had like what? Support on don donations maybe? Tips? Okay, that's wonderful. But how do I make money off depressed people? Please pass some of this on to Tom. I'm starting to feel bad for him. Thank you for the $50. I mean, none of that will see Tom's pockets, but uh, thank you nonetheless. Okay. What is this? You are not gonna believe this. Check this out. No, no. Are you serious? I've had- There is no way. It's been two years. Oh, are you kidding? No. That's not good. Tell me. Tell me you're lying. No shot, dude. Oh, oh my goodness. No way. Wait, he's doing a bit, but how did he get all that detritus? What, what the fuck? What is going on? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Fuck you. My shit's clean, son. No air filter. How can y'all live like that? Some people are nasty, bro. You are... I don't think that's real, is it? I'm a bit confused. I don't know. That feels like it's a bit. I don't want to get tricked by a bit. Hmm. Inconclusive. Inconclusive. Okay. <laughs> right. Okay, guys. There we go. There's the end of the Glup Shito, Tom Tent, um, Wick Tent, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to take a quick break. And then I shall return. And we've got a bit of Cine Jar Tent, I guess. Let's have a look at. It's a bit that he dumped out a week of trash for. Is that what actually happened, though? Dude, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, guys, listen, you should always be humble. 
I know I was, you know, larking about with, with income and shit. I, you know. Here's the situation, okay? Be humble. Stay humble. Stay foolish. Stay hungry. Stay foolish. I appreciate you all. I couldn't do it without you. And let's hope I never have to suffer the fate <laughs> of Tom Foolery. <laughs> okay. Right, give me a quick sec and I'll be right back, okay? Stay foolish, tomfoolery. <laughs> 